Hi, I'm Jimmy Chang, and we're here to talk about what is a special case in math. Now, special cases in math, uh, they happen all the time throughout, you know, the algebra, arithmetic, calculus, etc. And special cases can either present illustrations to a rule or uh, shortcuts that might make uh, applying something um, a little simpler, but it really depends on what the context is and what the scenario is. So, a special case, for example, in algebra would be special cases in factoring. So, if you have, like, um, the difference of two squares, you might be presented with this little fact, a squared minus b squared. So if you have two terms that are squared, subtracting by each other, it can be factored as a plus b, a minus b. Again, oftentimes special cases can help make the uh, solving a problem really, really easy. So if you have something like x squared minus 9, using this special case, x is squared, but 9 is considered 3 squared, this special case tells you that this can be factored very easily as x plus 3 x minus 3. Now, if you have another example using this idea, if you have 16y squared minus 25, for example, now y is a square, y squared is a square, but 16 is considered 4 squared, and 25 is considered 5 squared, this can be thought of as 4y plus 5 times 4y minus 5. So, again, there are many, many different special cases out there, but again, they're designed to present exceptions to a rule or a theorem or uh, give you an easier time to solve certain problems. So, I'm Jimmy Chang, and that's what is a special case in math.